Elderly brains may see too much. In fact, they may actually learn too much, which presents a problem in regards to what's called brain stability. I'm talking about stability as far as being able to filter out irrelevant information to focus on what you're supposed to learn. Younger individuals did a great job with that. Older individuals did a really good job too, until it was too much irrelevant information. And this is what the study was, and this is how incredibly counterintuitive it is. And remember, the study is being done in healthy individuals, individuals without dementia and without Alzheimer's. So, here we go. In a study published in Current Biology this November 2014, age-related declines of stability in visual perceptual learning, too long a title, so they shortened it to elderly brains learn, but maybe too much. Meaning, yes, they see everything. This is what they did. To conduct this study, Wantanabe and his team enrolled a group of 10 people between the ages of 67 and 79 years, another group of 10 people between the ages of 19 and 30, and gave them a simple visual exercise. So they were shown a quick sequence, like these, of six symbols, four letters, and two numerals. Volunteers were asked to report the numerals they saw. The performance on a test at the end of the training was compared to the score on a pretest. Just trying to get, get an idea of how well they learned. And this is what happened, which was quite intriguing. In this study, they found out that the older people learn just as well as the younger people when it came to this. And meaning it symbolized that the brain's plasticity was about equal. It did not decline as they aged. So, but in the study, when it came to the irrelevant skill of discerning the prevailing direction, let's say, for example, you see these dots in the cards on dot movement, Older people learned that too. Younger people didn't pay attention to that. The older people did. And it was even when it was most obvious. So what the researchers then did is take a step back. So the older people will be able to tell you what direction the arrows are moving, how many dots there were, the whole lineup. They could tell you everything. But when they changed the study parameters, actually older people were superior to younger people in that regard. Go back. When they changed the parameters, the researchers therefore subjected the volunteers to another test for the ability to find the relevant stimulus amid a number of distractors. Older people did notably worse than younger ones, adding evidence that the attentional systems for filtering out irrelevant stimuli were indeed weaker in older learners. To break it down for you, it's like this. Let's say you're playing a video game and you've got to go find your opponent across the screen. All right, so what happens is the younger learners will be able to take out all the irrelevant information the bullets flying across the screen, fires, sun, mountains, birds, whatever it is, and focus on their objective and filter out everything else. The older individuals, the ones uh, 67 to 79, would take it all in. The sun, the mountains, the birds, the flowers, the bullets, the fires, they see it all. But the problem is they're when unable to focus on the important part, their opponent across the screen. So when it comes to aging, the brain just tends to learn differently. Doesn't necessarily age in the way we think it does. Very counterintuitive article as opposed to the way we're actually trained to think that we actually got worse as we got older. No, we just became different. Ralph Turchiano signing off once again and thank you.